Hi, this is Brian Bennett for CNET, and right now we're taking a first look at the Sony Xperia Z Ultra Google Play Edition. Now, before I dive into what this smartphone can do, I have to say, man, this phone is massive, with a capital massive. It is one serious slab of mobile machine. With its humongous 6.44 inch display, the Z Ultra proves its moniker is no mere marketing boast, at least in the physical size department. Its gigantic footprint borders on the comical and pushes the phone tablet hybrid category to unheard of dimensions. Frankly, it manages to dwarf other devices, which until just recently I thought of as positively gargantuan. That includes the HTC One Max, Samsung Galaxy Note 3, and even the once king of mobile girth, the Samsung Galaxy Mega. Sony, though, does its best to minimize the impact of the Z Ultra's dimensions. The phone has an extremely thin chassis, which gives the device a shockingly flat appearance. This, coupled with the Z Ultra's glass construction, angular shape, and dark black colors, help the device achieve a very sophisticated and elegant look. The major distinguishing feature of the Xperia Z Ultra Google Play Edition, however, is its software. While not a true Google Nexus device, the phone runs a squeaky clean version of Android 4.4 KitKat, with all the bells and whistles that go with it. That includes a smarter, sharper looking interface, Google Now notifications, and advanced search, plus access to the company's vast catalog of digital content, apps, and services. Also, this device costs $649 and is sold directly through the Google Play Store in the US. Unlock the Xperia Z Ultra Google Play Edition is also designed to support GSM cellular networks and 4G LTE for fast mobile data. Inside, the Z Ultra's components are the same as its global predecessor. Just like its more worldly doppelganger, the Xperia Z Ultra GPE is powered by a state-of-the-art quad-core Snapdragon 800 processor paired with 2 gigabytes of RAM. There are 16 gigabytes of internal memory and a micro SD card slot for extra expansion. The only physical controls are on the right side, a silver circular power button and trim volume bar. Also here is a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. To meet its water-resistant rating, the Z Ultra's ports are all buttoned up under protective flaps as well. The handset can survive submersion at a depth of 5 feet for up to 30 minutes. On the back is the phone's main 8 megapixel camera and flash. Be warned though, like many of Sony's current Xperia phones, the Z Ultra's smooth, glossy surface is a grease and fingerprint magnet. I'm Brian Bennett for CNET, and you've just taken a first look at the Sony Xperia Z Ultra Google Play Edition. Be sure to check out our full review.